from where it comes from. Avoiding it and ignoring it will only make you suffer. And when you suffer, others will suffer. So the other part to this is a really nice little story. And it is a, it's, it's, a, it's a story that's been embedded in lots of different things. But I was watching a 2007 film called Pathfinder where an, an indigenous American speaks to Ghost, who's the son of a Viking. Uh, the indigenous American is called Starfire. And he says, There are two wolves fighting in each man's heart. One is love, the other one is hate. Ghost asks a very important question. Which one wins? And Starfire very sagely replies, the one you feed the most. Now, I'm not a prophet when I'm going to say that right now we tend to be feeding the black wolf, the wolf of hate. The divisions that have jumped out of the community fabric in the last few years, has been, it's just been phenomenal. We are more divided in many communities than ever before. And it doesn't matter whether we look at the UK, Europe, uh, Russia, the United States. And in Australia, we're sort of buffeted a lot, but it's still there and it's creeping in more and more. So in line of that, you know, I want to encourage you to speak out when you see wrongdoing of any kind. But most of, importantly, own your own wrongdoing. To do so strengthens the steel of our character and you know courage is to feel the fear and do it anyway that approach begins to truly nourish the soul in my view and on that you need to remember that none of us are an island unto ourselves and there are times many times when the needs of the others outweigh the needs of ourselves And finally, in today's podcast, I'm going to stress an important point. Exercise gratitude. The Katana Sutta says, the Buddha said, now what is the level of a person of no integrity? A person of no integrity is ungrateful and unthankful. This ingratitude, this lack of thankfulness is advocated by rude people. It is entirely on the level of people of no integrity. A person of integrity is grateful and thankful. This gratitude, this thankfulness is advocated by civil people. It is entirely on the level of people of integrity. Now, Many of us are already working on that. And for those of you who are still struggling with it, please persist because it will make a difference not to you but to all of us. So on that note, let me wish you all the best for the next week and by all means, exercise good, great mental health. Until next time, this is me signing off. Thank you for listening to Inspire Change with Gunter. Gunter Swoboda does individual and group coaching for men looking to grow. For more information on this and the global Making Good Men Great movement, check out goodmengreat.com to get into contact. If you have a topic for the show or would like to be a guest on the air, please email producers at Miranda at Nortainment.com. That's Miranda, M-I-R-A-N-D-A, at Nortainment, N-O-I-R-T-A-I-N-M-E-N-T.com. Thank you, and always keep inspiring change.